Um, you you uh, listed on your resume that you worked in the emergency, uh, sorry, not emergency, emerging technologies yeah. department at the library. So so tell me a little bit about that. What did, what did that job involve? So at the Stern Library, uh, when I was, so that was my first job, actually. Um, I was looking for a job when I started at UAV, and it was an on-campus job. And it's basically, they were starting a 3D printing and virtual reality studio. Um, for the UAB libraries, uh, which, and they were looking for the first cohort of employees of um, student assistants. Um, so we got to manage the 3D printers and set them up and like um, monitor them, um, make sure everything was working properly. So the 3D printers and the virtual reality equipment, um, we got to manage those. Um, and my supervisor was very nice because she let me actually make things and print it, print them. Um, so I got, I made a few things and uh, that they, I, I don't know if they still use it, but like one of the things I made was this hanger for the virtual reality headsets. Um, I modeled it on the computer and printed it and they, for a while we were using it to hang because the the wires are for the headsets, they're all over the place. Um, so we were trying to find a way to make it just follow the, um, user around and what was something fun that you yeah. guys were displaying on those virtual reality headsets what kind of so, what kind of things were people seeing in there most of it was medical based uh so like uh we had an anatomy software which you you actually got to look into the human body you can take organs and like you can essentially take a skeleton apart um and it would like give you a description of what's on, of what the part you're holding is. Um, we had another one that was space, which you could go to, you could scale out of the universe and make planets and you could um, make planets and place it somewhere and see how it interacts. Um, and it's actually very similar to how, um, it works very similar to how the physics of the normal universe works. Of course, they can't get it exactly, but um, you place a planet somewhere and everything around it, or you place a star somewhere and everything around it starts to pull closer because of gravity. Um, and just things like that. Um, we had one where you could go into, like you could zoom into the, I think molecular level. I think the closest you got to was uh, like into a red blood cell. Um, so you could zoom in and zoom out. Um, of a rat's um, interest. Um, so it, it was kind of, it was really cool working there. Um, okay, I think Praise, I have the, to tell you, once the really once the pandemic's over, I can tell you the first place I'm going, <laughs> I'm going to the library to, to do yeah. some virtual headset anatomy. That's, that's a, that sounds totally awesome. That's great. Yeah, it's at this 